So yeah. I had to find some peace. You know what I'm saying? Get some clarity in my head. You know? I was trying to think of what to say to somebody. Really, how can you make a low life or even lower than what he is? No oh, jewels can make him shine because it's low life DNA. No money can make him rich because he's always going to be a, a degenerate inside. So, The only thing I'm gonna say that, you know, I call him Baloney Tony. Moonshine for a reason. Just know that he's speaking nothing but lies. Once again, you should know that. You know your boy Cuban Link, do I ever gotta put no hands on a woman? Don't have to. Wasn't taught that way. I'm an advocate for that. I'm not an abuser, I'm not a bully. I'm the one who fights the bullies. I'm the one who stand up for them. That's me. Now, Tony Sunshine, he's the one who likes getting bullied. It's part of his DNA. His lifetime. Since he was a little kid, he did like a bigger guy always. Just to, you know? Smack him around and act, you know, the tough guy. And, and he's like, Yes, Pike, remember that, uh, that, uh, that cartoon back in the days and shit? WB cartoon? Yes, Pike, so you're gonna hit him right, Pike? God, shut up! <laughs> Tony was the little you're jumping around. Yeah. So that's why. So I can't respond and, and put him um, anywhere. He doesn't exist, but he, he does exist as an example. And uh, my, my testament is false, like what people do. Judas are real, you know, Judas are real, Peters are real, um, yeah, yeah, well, it's crazy, it's crazy what it is, but you know what, I'm gonna let y'all respond to it, what would you, what would you say to somebody that was once your friend, little, your little, you know, your little homie, he was younger than you, Y'all from the same hood, and, and you know, y'all chill, y'all have fun, y'all did this, you know, y'all did everything together, or some cool shit, you know, one day he steps out with you, you bring him with you, he goes to a club, he starts a fight, and you end up jumping in, just two of y'all against 20 niggas, first hit it goes down, but you fight, because you are built like the way you are, but your natural instinct was stand up for your, for your, for your friend. When he was outnumbered, when he somebody was messing with him, you stood up for, you know, with him and, and for him. You end up getting stabbed, you go to the hospital, you get stitched up, you know, you do what you do, right? Real shit, scar shit, right? Real enough shit, right? Then you bring him in. And then you get in a situation where you're into the music, you know, you come out with, 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 with a crew, you got full of clips, you know, it's, it's you, your man, you know, pun, of course. And then I'm like, come on, my nigga. After the stabbing and all that, you know, I forgave. Come on, man. Don't worry about that, baby. From the hood, and this shit happened. Because, you know, it's supposed to be real nigga shit, right? And now this nigga. Runs with that in me. I'm not even talking about just Joe. Runs with the enemy. Runs about downfall. Bad talks and you make up lies now. See how life is. So I don't really have no words, right? Because at the end of the day, this is a little nigga that I know everything he is is the, is the opposite. He talks tough. 
but he's far from tough. He looks in the mirror and thinks he's the handsomest nigga. But inside, how he looks is he feels ugly. He's unsure of himself. He is. That's why he's ugly. You know what I'm saying? He's, he's, he wants to escape the world, so he uses drugs. He uses drugs. To the point where he was begging on, you know, on the street for nickels and dimes, opening gas station doors. What can I say about that? That's the same guy right now talking about broke niggas. Two years later, he thinks this is like Christianity. Like he got saved, so he's like, all the sins are going away. All the memories of niggas are going away when they seen them, you know what I'm saying, uh, sleeping in the fucking in, in, in Pebble Beach and in, in, in Forest Projects in, in the top. And then they seen them, you know, uh, overdose in, in, in Danny Loco's barbershop in, in the bathroom. He thinks people forget that. So, what can I say to a guy like that? And then I forgive him again. That they bad talking me the first time. But they, I accepted him again. And then he was, that's when he had the, the real crackhead shit. That's when he was Pookie. I, I came, he came back like Pookie. Now he wants to be my friend after he's Pookie. Wait, wait, he's over there with the Tony Sunshine, you know, singing, I don't know. He's over there talking shit about me. Turns to Pookie, he wants to fuck with QB. Yeah, okay. Cool. Could we accept this him? Because the hood wants the love and the gillies and the little hex and the sing sings and the Dali Locos. They want us to have. I say, you know what? I know I need to give him some tough love. And I should have given him the tough love that he needed. And I told all of them to be shy. I should have did it. A little trip to the hospital. It's still love. They told me no. Do business. I tried. Ah, uh, yeah, another one. God, another fucking axe in my back. <laughs> Soon as he got, you know, he went to the rehab. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Took care. Put a little water in him. Uh, Twenty-one days. Uh, he came back. He went to jail. <sighs> Straight extra deep throat. Jumped over there again. Fuck Cuban Link again. Now it's forget it. So what can I say to a guy like, y'all tell me, what can I say? And now he's making up lies, now, now they got me. He got, now he's making up lies. Come on, man. Come on, kid. I can see you, man. We know who you are. You scared little boy. Still need a person to help you. you. Never stood in your own two feet. Never. Got nine kids. I'm supposed to be a role model, not just acting like. Uh, uh. Nigga, you gotta be. You gotta have that morals there so you can pass them down. You gotta have that valor. So you can teach your kids to be brave. You gotta have that honesty. So you can let your kids trust you. You gotta have that loyalty to those who put it in for you, not in you. You understand? I want you to stay here. Did things that, that, that are admirable. That's what you teach your kids. You gotta have love. gotta have redemption and you gotta have humility you got a lot of teachers to do but I don't think you fit for the job man so fans those watching I, I have no more words for this dude you understand I was here thinking what to say? Not even mad. I was just like, how could I say it in a way that? But it's like too much thinking about this thing. But I have to answer, right? Because now he's making allegations, and I thought he talking about, you know, either Joe. I really thought he was talking about Joe. You know, he was a pun. At that, I was like, how disgusting can he be talking about pun? But you talking about me only? <laughs> when the fuck did you ever see me lay a hand on any women? You're crazy.
Y'all niggas want to make believe? Yeah, in your own world. Y'all been living on it. And you've been in Joe's world a long time, so. La La Land. House of Lies. It's coming down, nigga. Hey. <laughs>